My name's uh, Michael Flynn and I live in Bispam in Blackpool. Since April 12th last year I've been in and out of hospital. Um, I had pneumonia last April and I was in overnight and then I was back in for five nights in May last year on Ward 24 who were brilliant. Um, and then yeah I've been in and out since and they've got sacrodosis and asthma and been referred to Preston Specialist Asthma Team. And I um, work for Healthwatch Blackpool, which is part of Empowerment um, in Bisping. I have someone, when I go to appointments at, um, at my doctors or GPs, I always have my boss, Beth, always comes with me. Or when I go and see, like I saw Dr. Uh, Villaris yesterday, so I, I do prefer someone to come with me, so it would help if there was someone sort of there to support me because I'm coming up on my own, uh, so it'd be good to have someone from like the LD, LD nurse w there to support because when I was in on Ward 24 I had um, someone called Leanne Geegan from work and she was sort of my go-between between me and the hospital, she'd get the information off the hospital and relay it to me in a way that I'd understand because you get all the hospital jargon so she'd relay it back to me in a way that I understand because I have a learning disability so it's like what? What do you mean? So she'd get the information then relay it back to me which she shouldn't have to do because she was doing this out of her work hours so should be someone there from the LD side to come to you and explain it to you rather than have a third party explain it to you. Always ask me if I need help and if I've got my hospital passport because I have additional needs like Asperger's, asthma and sacrodosis. So yeah, it would be great if staff would ask if I have that where it's got all my information. In June 2020, the Trust signed up to the Hidden Disability Scheme. We were the first NHS Trust to do this in the north of England. Reception desks across all of our sites have the Hidden Disability Sunflower lanyards available for patients or carers to wear. The lanyards alert our staff that the patient may need some assistance during their stay or appointment. Yeah, uh, the lanyards are really positive and good. I don't... I don't do meeting new people because I get nervous when I meet new people yeah. and it's yeah just different environments meeting new people different I don't socialize a lot because I find it hard to socialize once I went to Whitegate Drive uh, the urgent care old urgent care um, part and the receptionist uh, so that had me sunflower lanyard on and it did make a difference because she says do you need somewhere quiet to sit or do you want just happy and I thought well, well, yeah if it was, so she gave me a quiet area to sit in away from the other people.